Let's critique a persuasive text, which is all about the fact that dogs are better than cats. What is critiquing? Critiquing is giving an opinion and providing evidence. Sometimes we're taking a look at the author's opinion, finding out what the author thinks, and sometimes we're giving our own opinion about what we've just read. So let's take a look at this introduction, which says that dogs are definitely better than cats. Have a think about these four questions, pause the video, write down your answers, and on the next slide, you'll see more about uh, the answers to these questions. Take a look at this, talk to a buddy, were you on the right track for finding out the author's opinion? Because the author expresses their opinion by using persuasive techniques. And so we need to find out the author's opinion by taking a look at the author's reasons and also taking a careful look at the author's persuasive techniques. Let's have a look at this section here where the first reason that the author has given is unpacked by the author. So answer these questions, pause the video, have a bit of a think and see what you come up with. So talk to a buddy and see whether you had the same ideas about your opinion, about the author's opinion and about the persuasive techniques used by the author. Let's have a look at this paragraph and let's talk about the author's opinion and let's talk about persuasive techniques used by the author and your own opinion. Using your own knowledge, what are two extra ways that you believe that dogs keep us fit? So pause the video and have a go. Talk to a friend and discuss whether you had the same ideas to answer questions 9 to 11. So let's have a look here at the paragraph that talks about dogs being helpers. And in your opinion, which are the two strongest examples below? And why do you believe that they are powerful examples? And then find the actual persuasive techniques that the author has used to show their opinion and to convince you. Stop the video and have a go. How did you go? Talk with a buddy and see how you went in answering questions 12 and 13. And finally, in the conclusion, what's your opinion here about the conclusion? Do you believe it's well written? So give your evidence about whether you think this is a well written conclusion or whether you think this could be stronger. Pause the video and have a go. And looking here at quiz question 14, talk to a buddy about what your opinion was about the conclusion. Because the really important thing about critiquing is that you always have to have evidence for your opinion.